Hello, gays, ghouls, and everyone in between, and welcome to our YouTube channel, The, the Horror, Horror Bandwagon. Hi, my name is Sergio. And my name is Cody. And we're your boys for horror analysis. Criticism. And spooky, ooky. And sometimes kooky. Entertainment. And guys, we have returned with Cody I'm this here. time. He is no longer working. He's been working since the last video that we released. Nonstop. Yeah, and we got rid of our dog. No, I'm kidding. Oh my gosh. No, no, no. We're, we still have him. He's actually wandering around here somewhere. Right down at our feet. Right down at our feet. You'll probably see him in the background. Don't worry. It's not an intruder. It is our dog roaming around. So, Also, if you haven't noticed, I'm going to be a little bit spooky. Just for the next few videos, maybe for the rest of my life. Um, <laughs> <laughs> but because of Halloween season, spook season is already in full effect. We're going to try out a little bit of things. Maybe have Cody try in a little bit of things. So I have my glowing red eyes right now. And I have my glowing regular eyes right now. Because Which is scary <laughs> enough, because honestly. I, I have special eyes. Yeah, glasses enough. Oh my God. <laughs> That's the spook factor right there. But you should expect for the next few videos that we're probably going to be dressing up a little bit. Mm -hmm. So don't be alarmed. I try to make weird faces with my eyes and my contacts move. So I'm like, ugh. <laughs> but we don't want to drag this on any further. We need to get right into the content of this video. What are we doing today, Cody? Today we are watching the first episode of the new Child's Play series. Yes, episode one, which is actually released already on YouTube. You can watch it for free. Uh, right there and that's honestly what we're gonna do so this is going to be our instant reaction just like based off us watching it for the first time we have not seen the episode at all we've seen the trailers of course so we'll see we don't know what to expect honestly but hold on before we continue we do have to let you guys know please go ahead and like subscribe and press that notification bell because mm -hmm. We are just going to be uh, releasing these episodes each week where we react to each episode of the Chucky series. Yeah, bringing you new and amazing and exciting content. Mm -hmm. And make sure to go check out our podcast, The Horror Bandwagon, anywhere you get your podcasts. We just started season three and we're really excited to bring oh, you a lot of fun yes. movies. Yes, yes, yes. Every week. Mm -hmm. Oh my God, I'm just like feeling myself in, like, in these eyes. <laughs> So guys, go ahead and sit back, relax, and watch it along with us. We have our drinks in hand. Mm -hmm. We have our drinks in hand. Sorry. <laughs> I'm nervous. Another three <laughs> bodies were found by the Hackensack Mall last night. Hackensack. That brings the total that's close to us. Yeah, that's near us. Is it really? Mm -hmm. oh, okay. Also, don't hunt us down. <laughs> you don't know where we live. This is like giving me very um beginning of seed of chucky but also very the beginning of halloween the original one. oh yes povs we're always going to compare them you're right though this is more halloween what did we just watch was this a flashback fake out or like a dream sequence i do love this look of chucky though does he look good i said it on like on the first viewing i was like his hair locks look amazing mm -hmm. somebody got a wig upgrade mm -hmm. also the fact that we have a chucky movie taking place around halloween fall vibes honestly i don't remember you into vintage no i'm into retro oh what's the difference about 10 bucks <laughs> fair enough oh someone took the butcher knife Hackensack. Oh my god. There's a podcast. Name Hack Hackin' Slash. We're being called out. But hack and slash, it's like a it's a good play on words. I do like it. Fucked up in the straight up criminally insane. The song in the does bop. alone, our murder rate has spiked 25%. In fact, we haven't seen this kind of violence here since the Ray family murders in 65. That's a smart way to kind of introduce like mm -hmm. the exposition just yeah. like the like he's just listening to a podcast Although, on his way home insanely short podcast that's all you need quick and simple <laughs> listen 
Oh my god. Okay. This is art. I can't. This I, is. I mean, this is giving me like, bring Sid from Toy Story into the 21st century. There's, there's a cat. Listen, I'm no fan of cats, but this cat, I'm worried about you, girl. Oh no. Oh no. Mm -mm. Yeah, Chucky did not like that. Ugh. Oh. Mm. Cat's right. <laughs> he really is. Lube! <laughs> oh my God. I feel like we're going to get so many gay innuendos. Mm hmm. Which is, I mean, this, that's, that's our entire life. <laughs> that's the knife you're going to use to cut off his head? Yeah, what else are you going to do? I mean, you should just, like, take a machete. And just, like... Yeah, because every teenager just casually has a machete. Well, it's better than that, like, tiny Swiss Army knife. Hi-dee-ho! <laughs> it's voice activated. I was thinking about using his head for the sculpture. What do you think? I don't know. I'm no art critic. Well, I'm not asking for a review, Dad. I just want your opinion. It's cool, Jake. I kind of think that's the same thing. Much time, wasn't it? <laughs> you know, it's almost impossible to make a living as an artist. Mom did. That wasn't a living. That was a lifestyle, and it certainly didn't pay the bills. All of us like being triggered right now, being mm -hmm. like, oh, "God." <laughs> You know, you're looking more. Oh. Besides, you don't want to be away from me for a whole month, do you? <laughs> <laughs> Parents always set themselves up for like a, such a bad. Did Chucky just find his first victim? Okay, uh, this is creepy. That's a cool that is way cool. To, okay. Yeah, I like it. Can't remember the last oh, time we just that girl is from something. For pizza. <laughs> she does look familiar. Luke, you got a little something on your. Uh, oh my god, that's going to kill me. Other side. Oh, are we having two Devin Savills right now? So how's business? Well, Jen Jen has some news. Mom, guess who made regionals? Holy shit! Oh, that's great, Junior. Isn't that great, Jake? Huh? He's the best distance runner at Perry Middle since... Hell. Well, since his fall. But regionals is on the 10th. Uh, the scouts are taking gaze now. You should totally come <gasps> check it out. Junior. What? It's oh, my God. So what does that mean exactly? Eagle Scout. Did you, like, sell the most cookies? No, well, you were up in your room playing with dolls. I organized a whole book drive for the homeless. Yeah, because... Keeping up with Harry Potter is the most pressing issue facing the homeless. Read him. Would you give it a rest? He's 13 years old. He doesn't know what he is. 14. I think that's a tall 14-year-old. <laughs> yeah. Um... It's upstairs where it's always been. <gasps> she was in Jason X. That's what she was. She was the lead girl in Jason X. Me. That's the chair that Chucky was in. I only have a minute. I'm with my nice. family. <laughs> I don't know. That is an awful blazer. I mean, yeah, I don't like it. I wanted to like it, but I don't think I like it. Hey, girl. <laughs> girl, sci-fi just giving me jump scares right now. <laughs> Sounds about right. Mm -hmm. <gasps> no! Oh my god! This poor kid. That's gotta be traumatizing. I would be so mad. No more dolls, Jake. Ever. Was well, Chucky just like hiding? Just like, yeah. oh, sh oh shit. <laughs> it's like, I can't, I can't do that. Gotta get out of there. <laughs> I don't know you. So I'm guessing like this is what like <gasps> Chucky, that's not cool. 
I'm not sure that I believe that there is just a true crime titled magazine. True crime. Because it like <laughs> looks like a like like an Us Weekly. Yeah. Like, <laughs> that's a podcaster, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, oh my God. Oh, girl. Oh, no. Oh, I want them to get together. No. I'm already on this kid's side, so yeah. I'm like very happy. Awesome, good guy. I'm into vintage too. Oh, he, he's retro. Oh my God. Okay, he's very like <laughs> adamant about kid. that. Like, Come on. We, okay, we, we get it. You know, like. <laughs> Do you think that you can, like, maybe introduce me to your cousin? I get that a lot. <laughs> I'm flattered. Really, oh but my God. it's not my thing. What's your name? Hi, I'm Chucky. Wanna play? Oh my God, that's adorable. Say cheese. Chucky cheese. <laughs> <laughs> Got us. Got us. Well, actually, I'm going to sell them. Oh, you're selling your stuff now, Jake? I didn't realize it gotten that bad. Oh, well, fuck you. You need to borrow any money? No. Oh, my God. Seriously, it's no problem. You're going from zero to 100 real fast. Like, being financially disadvantaged is nothing to be ashamed of, Jake. Right? That is a really, <laughs> really easy thing to say from a point of privilege. But oh, my God, this girl. Oh, that was so funny. She literally was like, you, you look poor. <laughs> like, I'm hoping that she's like a mean girl who's bitchy, who were like on her side a little bit. Like Regina George is like a mean girl. Yeah. Like obviously she said awful things. But at the same time, I'm hoping like she'll be like a gay icon. <laughs> Everyone's commenting. No. <laughs> Do this. Do you have a religious conflict? No, I just I can't stand the sight of blood. Pussy. Oliver, mind your fucking business. <gasps> oh <laughs> yes, thank you. Teachers with a the clapback. These are freshly killed. That that doesn't seem humane. I know. <gasps> no. <laughs> Chucky's like, I'll take care of it. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> That's definitely inhumane. Oh. Oh, uh, no, Jake, that isn't quite right. What is going on? Lexi's new GoFundMe. <sighs> Oliver, let me see that. I mean, it's not that funny. Don't spend it all in one place. Oh, my God. I'd suspend him for that. Okay, for homework. Don't forget your boy toy. Oliver, get the hell out of here. <laughs> also. Just a moment, Lexi. I'd like a word. Yes, thank you. Close the door. Have a seat. Thank they you. really cast this girl really well. <laughs> I will say, that actress is great, though, to be able to just, like, make us hate her instantly. But at the same time... No, I do hate her. But in a good way. <laughs> no, I hate her in a bad way. She's like sassy, attitude -y, like she's perfect slasher, mean girl, you know? She's not like throwing the F-bomb like to everybody right now. So it's like, that's good. It is. Uh, you are missing him watching Vampire Diaries actually. asking what, what he's know? listening to when he was just listening to his podcast. Coolio. Coolio. I used to say that a lot. So did I. Oh. <laughs> well, first of all, I know you listen to my show. That's not a question. Uh, well, I mean, I know you're listening just now. I saw. Okay. I think maybe you'd be interested in coming on my podcast. <gasps> what? I want to do a whole series on bullying, Jake. I thought you were in a true crime. Bullying is a crime, Jake. And you just here in Hackensack, we have Lexi, Oliver. And Junior? No. Junior's a good guy. Junior's my cousin. Believe me, he's not a good guy. Shit, I gotta go. Oh, uh, disappointing. I mean, clean up after yourself, at least. Loser. Oh, this guy looks like he could kill people. <laughs> Look at... <gasps> oh! <laughs> First time action. Yes. 
I mean, the cinematography is really cool. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we're kind of like, this is perfect. This is what I love about slashers. It's like, get her. Like, <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> Going on. Nothing. Okay, I have to go. I have rehearsal. Rhode Island. Fast. Hello? Yeah, I'm calling about the doll. I was fast. What can did anything weird happen lately? I mean with Chuck. Well, this conversation's been pretty weird. Be very careful with that Kids. doll. <laughs> you understand? That's our man. Mm -hmm. I like that he just looked at the title and yep. was like, that's weird. <laughs> I'm just going to stop now. <gasps> that's so weird because I thought the trailer's showed that it had batteries in it yeah it probably did so that this would be a freak out moment oh shit wow that was a although all this time and chucky hasn't gotten someone to put batteries in his back it was like hey can you just like put that in there just yeah. like <laughs> i keep getting caught this way <laughs> <laughs> brava brava <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. <sighs> if she doesn't, girl's if she doesn't come through. out and do uh, Sharpay's song from High School Musical in this outfit. Which one? In the second one or in the first in one? In the first one. I kind of love her outfit. Really? I do. I hate it. What did you think of Devin? Who is a spotlight person just being He's like, you? Yeah. Good. Come on, Jake. Don't be shy. Now's your chance to tell Dev and his mom <gasps> what you really think. What? What is with this girl? Oh my god. <gasps> Pick on someone your own size. <laughs> <laughs> Bought his own ticket, you know. Mm -hmm. Little help here, Jake. What's her name? Lexi? Yeah. Okay, of course. Uh, no shade to Lexi's out there, but I just like, like I don't like, like the blue heels. I was actually gonna say the opposite. I hate the outfit, <gasps> but I love the blue heels, and I wish that she was wearing something no, to match them. I wish. <gasps> My phone. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's pics of Oliver too. Uh oh. Guess that was a secret. <laughs> <laughs> Get her, Jade. Yeah. <laughs> we all have our secrets. Right, Bree? <gasps> What's that mean? She's into Pokemon porn. <laughs> look, but she keeps Googling. What, do my farts smell so good? <laughs> <laughs> so why does she Google it multiple times? A bunch of fucking assholes. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, Chucky just spitting out facts. Seriously. I love it. What's my fault? Is the son you taller your than him? In your family, in front of the entire school. They deserved it. And they're not my friends. They used to be. You used to have friends, Jake. What happened to you? Uh, they grew up and became you assholes. Everybody thinks you're fucking weird, huh? You don't care that they think I'm weird. You just care that they know I'm a fag. <gasps> oh my listen, god! Listen to me. Go to your room. Go. I don't oh. want to see you anymore. Get up there. Why is he still wearing his <laughs> he just coveralls? Like it's like, hey, Arnold, you know, he always has. That's the only wardrobe here. But has. he took off his shoes and socks. Oh, I'm getting uh, uh, bare feet on wooden stairs. Never. Gives me PTSD from uh, A Quiet Place. But also the same thing kind of happened in um, Child's Play 2. With like the foster dad. Who oh, was, yeah. Like down the basement. Mm hmm. Like
Oh, <gasps> so this is like a fascinating death, but this is literally what circuit breakers are supposed to prevent from happening. So I'm like kind of taken out of it a little bit. What? So he's dead? I guess so. I mean, I'm, I'm going to again say I don't know that it's the, the most realistic death, but like, remember, Cody's the skeptical one here. <laughs> he will. He's a cynical. He'll he'll call it out. Circuit breakers are supposed to trip if there's like a huge like like <laughs> arc out of nowhere that's not normally there. Oh, is this the mom that's right. of Devin? Yes, okay. I think so. Your uncle's on his way over. He's going to take you to stay at his place tonight. Is that okay, Jake? Oh, they're going to think he did it. Mm -hmm. Although, technically, because he's under 18, he should have an attorney present because he doesn't have a parent or guardian. Like, whatever they're getting Like, his here uncle be... should be there. Yes. Or an attorney. They should have, they should have an attorney representing him. Today. You're incredible. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have lied. I've never done anything like that before. Don't worry. You're not in any kind of trouble. Whoa. <laughs> Why are they zipping that up in front of the kid? It is very convenient. Just like, hey, just one more look. No? Okay. Like, it was an interesting reveal, but... Was he drinking? Looks like it. Yes. Thank you. Yeah, because they'll probably see the bottle was like. Mm -hmm. So you're gonna come stay with us now. We figured. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Why don't you show Jake to his room? Shit. Can you just do it, please? <sighs> The guy's dad just died. Um, Your uncle. Thanks, Embry. I feel like she's a flawed character, but she's good. Yeah, I think that she means well. Yeah. Right now, she's my Jake, favorite from that family. What did you mean today? At the talent show, you know, about me having a secret. Um, I, I was just trying to be funny. Um, I, didn't, I didn't mean anything by it. I'm sorry. Okay. I feel like the show is setting it up that she's having an affair. I think so too. But I'm wondering if. But Don like, Mancini is not that. Like he's not that. He doesn't give that away too easily. Well, yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Is I think that it's it's a red herring. Yeah. I think that she's like either seeing a therapist secretly or like. Or like the like this is not her th like the her the like son. only family or something. Not her own family or this son isn't the actual son of the guy. Yeah. It's a talk to me. Call back to the first tricky. I'm gonna meet you. <laughs> like, bitch. <laughs> Hi, I'm Chucky. And I'm your friend to the end. Heidi fucking. <laughs> oh, yes. I'm loving this like new sassy Chucky. It's like, hey. Oh, I love this organ music. Wait, that fit in there? They always fit in there. Let's talk about that bitch, Lexi. Huh. Yeah, I'm glad they have that. <gasps> oh, that's so nice. Yeah. I gotta say, I feel like, like sci-fi movies are always like campy. But their TV shows are usually really good. And Yo, this is gonna, like shaping up to be exactly like that. I have to admit, I always thought, I'm not going to lie. I judged sci-fi because they're kind of the source of Sharknado. Yeah. So like, yeah. we figured, like, we figured, okay, it's going to be crazy. But like, wow, I they, they really gave a lot of freedom to Don Mancini to create what he needed to be created. And I was, I'm honestly so surprised at how well... A TV series of Chucky is going. Yeah, I. I Where also, now I'm like, we probably should have horror movies like this all the time. Yeah. <laughs> I also really love that, like, 
Chucky is almost like acting as as this kid's defender. Well, I think that's what it's going to start off as. Yeah. It's like, we're like, yeah, yeah. And, and but think, he starts to like make really dark decisions later mm-hmm. on. And then we're like, oh, this is not fun anymore. This is this is just, this is giving me very um, Little Shop of Horrors vibes right now. Like, sit, like um, Seymour, Audrey 2 relationship. Yeah. Where like, it starts <gasps> oh, off yeah, good. Yeah. Give and me more slowly, blood. Like, like Chucky gets a little bit worse. Mm-hmm. And at some point he's like, I don't know that I like this anymore. Like you're taking it too far. Oh, yeah, absolutely. But again, like the thing with Don Mancini, what I've seen from this past is that all his writing really is thought out and he does have a lot of twists and turns, like especially with like uh, Curse of Curse of Chucky. Uh, he had that whole twist where you thought they were having an affair, but it was actually the mom who was having an affair with the other, with the nanny. Mm -hmm. And it's kind of like, oh, okay, you spun that on us. So I really, really am excited as to where Don Mancini is going to take us on this route. And it seems like the whole cast, uh, especially with the marketing, seemed like they all had like a wonderful time. Mm -hmm. And they're really excited about this. And they're really excited about the product. So... I, I honestly can't wait to, for episode two. Oh, my God. Me, too. Oh, my God. Uh, really shitty characters, again, <laughs> in a good way, where Don yeah. Anthony is giving us a lot of depth. That's the thing. All these characters we, we got to know in the first episode, we're now like, okay, we accept them, mm-hmm. and we're now going forward with them. And I feel like he's definitely going to drag out the death you know like we're not gonna see lexi die in the second episode i don't think no i think i think she's gonna she's gonna have a couple brushes and i want to say i feel like she it like chucky's gonna keep her alive for a while to like really taunt with her yeah and then at some point like she's gonna start trying to tell everybody that like it's it's chucky and like no one's gonna believe her believe her yeah and then she probably starts to befriend him a little bit. Oh, maybe. Don't you think? I, I, it could be a, a thing where, like, they come together at the end and now have to stop Chucky. But I also want to know, like, what Andy Barkley, like, what his role is going to be in this. Obviously, he's going to try to hunt down Chucky. Mm-hmm. And his reveal is going to be amazing. Obviously, we have now Jennifer Tilly, who is also oh a God, villain. I'm so excited. And Jennifer Tilly is going to come in. And I don't even know how, like, what is going to happen. And I'm, like, so freaking excited about it Don Mancini good for you of course a gay icon and we are supporting you guys make sure that you also go ahead and tune in get them to have those views those numbers be brought up Um, but you can also catch us here on this channel because we are going to be reacting to every episode yes we will be (laughs) we're 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 stoked okay so make sure that you like subscribe and press the notification bell to follow up with us whenever we release a video and with that being said we have been your source for horror analysis criticism and spooky okay and sometimes kooky entertainment bye everyone (laughs) 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 